All right, can we salvage the last one? True, one more artifact in play as well would have given us a life back, although, so it does unlock the tomb. All right, last match, trying to fight back to a two and three against the Sham Wow dude. You follow me, camera guy? We're on the draw. Let's try not to name mana artifacts with Spyglass. Oh, well now they know what's going on. <coughs> Perhaps we could ask them for advice on our sequencing. Well, at first I was thinking, yeah, we turn off Black Lotus because in my head I was thinking of Prixian Revoker, Pithing Needle type effects. And then when they had the Lotus anyway, it's like, oh, right, yeah, that's not how that works. All right, so they got four cards left. Assassin's Trophy, Assassin's Trophy, Misty Rainforest, and Wasteland. Cool. Hmm. I don't have basics, I don't believe. But let's make it harder on. Take it. Son of a gun, none of them in there. Oh, hello there. So they're down in Assassin's Trophy. Sure. I mean, that that'll do. Uh, I'll keep this one. You got an Oko? Bravo, you got an Oko.
Nice draw steps. Can't play that yet, so I'll go with this. Do I need to defend? Probably. Still don't have black mana for the other trophy we know they already had. How about? I mean, <laughs> I mean, that was pretty good. Although it doesn't matter against Wasteland and then the other trophy with Oko in play. So if I were to tap to do, if I tried to go Helm, Helm costs one more, so I couldn't even play it all the way out. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe they'll mess up. They won't mess up. Five. I would have to tap out everything to do it. Going to five. They just wake up, attack, and kill. Whatever. Let's put another one out there. See what happens. Maybe they'll F6. Oh, they didn't. All right, they figured it out. All right, so. Against a Oko deck, that's what the Spyglasses are going to do a lot of heavy lifting. Something like Warm Coil seems like it could be good. Crucible as well. They don't really play the stuff out of the graveyard though. Lodestone feels kind of underwhelming against the Tarmogoyfs of the world. Maybe, I don't know. Tabernacle also feels weak. Tabernacle could be a bog. I guess you already have the ley lines though. It's going to be different being on play versus draw. <laughs> I I would agree. Thorn is on the weaker side too. It's just, do I really want Worm Coil? Sure. Play first. Play first with a turn one nothing. Not impressive. I mean... They have mold of five. Ha! 
How you lose? I'm doing that so that when I actually play the helm, I can activate it. I should have waited because of because of force of vigor though. I should have waited to their upkeep to get them to try to use it. All right, so they got energy flux, energy flux. Collector oofs. I see a lot of ways we lose. We lose we lose a lot of cards. A lot of cards we lose. All right, I don't I don't think we can beat energy flux. I don't like that guy. He's in like a dead card. We could, that's true, a chalice on three would do that. Assassin's Trophy, Death Rite, Misty, Polluted Delta, Wasteland. So I would need to turn off. I could turn off Wasteland. Let's turn off Death. Like we could turn off. They play wasteland, they'd be able to clear that one. I think we turn off Death Right Shaman first. This is not a mana ability. I don't believe. See now they didn't they didn't play any lands. They didn't play any lands which really kind of confuses me. Or no, they wastelanded me. Okay. I was like what the hell just happened? No, they wastelanded me, dummy. Okay. I was wondering what the hell happened. Hmm. I think because I have the yield all on, it just kind of flew through my turn. Played the Misty. It's getting an underground.
so then the question is, do I get I don't want to expose dark depths yet. They have their own wasteland now, sure. So they have polluted delta, green sun, and a friend. Still have green sun available to them. Okay. They gonna go get collector oof now? We get a Tarmogoyf, but I wasn't thinking to collector of, yeah. We could one more one more Bajuka Bog and we could cast it. Getting closer. We play Urborg and then we cast the ley line. <laughs> and then we just get something sweet next turn. Maybe they'll counter it. We tricked them. All right. Uh, I don't see how we get out of this anymore. Yep, we're going to get attacked for lethal. So we're just going to go down. Nope. We're dead. Perish. Perish would have been great. Well, that was... That definitely had some fun games. I mean, being able to race your own mana crypt while thawing out Dark Depths, that in itself was memorable. So, and I mean, we only lost one match, O2. We did manage to pick up a game everywhere else, so that was pretty nice, that it, it wasn't all... It wasn't all bad news, but... Uh, Thanks everybody for hanging out this afternoon. Um, like I said, I just I wanted to do something. I wanted to do something at least, you know, as as long as I was home. And we're gonna be, we're we're really we're not doing anything for the holiday. Oh, Steve, you missed it against. You have to go back in the game one that I won. We were racing our own mana crypt while thawing out dark depths and I chose tails every turn and I lost the flip at least four, if not five turns in a row. And it all came down to, could we win the flip on the last turn? I stuck with it and we got there. 
So that is that is definitely worth going back to check out because that was pretty sweet. But for everybody else, like I you could check out the VODs on demand. I do plan to maybe do some kind of stream tomorrow just because we're not we're not going anywhere. The the safe responsible thing to do is stay at home, stay within your household. So stay safe everybody. I, I want I want to be able to keep playing for you and I want you there to keep watching. So Thank you, Mana Traders, for allowing us to borrow these cards. The fact you sponsor the stream is really the only reason we can keep doing it. So, all right, everybody, take care. Have a good one.